Hey everybody, you know who it is? Hunter Valentine. This is at 1.08 p.m. Pacific California time, USA, Friday, <clears throat> March 16th. Okay, so this is my thing here. Um, I talked to the doctors and stuff, and apparently the hospital's real busy going on right now. Um, I do need to have it, you know, this taken care of. But um, they said, do you mind holding off until Monday when I can actually be stationed in for an actual thing where they won't get pulled away from the surgery and someone else would have to take over? And I said, yeah. I said, look, I'm on federal disability. I mean, what am I going to do? I said, so I'll be stuck here for a couple of days. I said, you guys told me possibly 30 days, so we'll find out from here. So um, they gave me lunch. You guys can see it over my shoulder back there. Oh, pardon me back there. They gave me a low fat one. Um, it's lasagna and uh, some broccoli and some uh, cauliflower. Low fat milk and um, what was it? Uh, some cut up pears and some tea with, low, sh with uh, low sugar and some lemon juice and a little bit of butter with a roll. Now what's funny is it tasted like sawdust, but when you haven't eaten in a couple of days, guess what? That was the best meal I ever had in a long time. <laughs> um, some of the student nurses came in, and I said, now make sure when you prick my finger, the hand is hanging down like it's supposed to, like this, so the blood goes into the finger, so there'll be blood in there, because my fingertips don't get a lot of blood in it. And they said, okay, no problem. Guess what? They prick my finger, squeeze it not enough blood comes out and she smears it on it for the blood test for the uh, blood sugar and messes it up oh uh, i'm gonna have to re-prick your finger and i'm already looking like what the didn't say a word let her do it she finished oh she like that she's going do you want to guess what this what the um do you want to guess what the number is and i'm going looking at her like she's crazy and so she left now before this happens I've had diabetes now for over two years. And I've been in a hospital so many times. The nurse comes in, I get woken up, I was having a bad dream about my mom passing away. Uh, it was a weird dream, I was fighting with some people or something like that and, and so I wake up, she wakes me up, she goes, I'm supposed to give you this, what's this? Oh, it's a manual, how to deal with diabetes. I said, ma'am, I've had diabetes for two years. Two freaking years. And she wants this thing to hand it to me now? I've had it for two years, I don't need to give it back to her. Well, I'm supposed to give it back to her. Well, I said, look, give it back to her, put it down on the table and say, ask her if she's stupid. She goes, I'm not gonna do that. I said, then disconnect me from this IV right here, and I will go take care of it, sir, I will not do that. I said, then take that away from me right now, otherwise you guys are wasting paper. I said, I'm sorry if I'm in a bad mood. I said, but that's the stupidest thing I ever heard of. And then the, the poor uh, student nurses came in, so that's why I kept my mouth quiet. Otherwise, you guys know me, I think I would have, what, vented very well with them. So I finally calmed down and everything and laid back down. Then there's a knock at my door. Not my door, there's two doors here. I have my door here, then there's another door on the other side and everyone keeps knocking at that door. So I closed this one and opened the other one so they would quit knocking on the door and bugging me. Because every time if I doze off, guess what? You hear, yeah, oh nothing, I'm just going in here. Then quit knocking on the fucking door. Oi. By the way, um, I want to thank you for everyone who's been saying things. Now, I've been saying a few people have been saying thank you. The Reply Girl I want to thank. I want to thank um, um, Happy Cabby. Yeah. Happy Cabby. I'm sorry I support him. Yes, he's a great person. If you have any questions that comes to, like, about YouTube and need answers, there might be in his videos and stuff, and he'll direct you to the video, which one it is, or give you the link. Or, um, you know, he can, he'll actually point something out to you. But he's a very knowledgeable man. People give him a lot of shit, but guess what? They deserve the shit they get back. 
Now, he does a lot of stuff for the lulls. So do I. If I think it's funny or if I think I can make someone laugh, guess what? I'm down for it. No, I won't drop my zipper to make a woman laugh. So stop that, atheist juggalo. Anyway, so once again, like I said, sorry I'm missing the wedding nappy and Care Bear and everybody that's going to be out there. Anyway, it's been over a five-minute video. This is my catch-up here. I guess this will be five point... Oh, wait, no, two point two... No, two point three for today. So I'm not going to make try not to make a lot of videos, but as everyone keeps saying, just keep making them. I'm trying not to. I can't play Call of Duty from here. This computer will not support it. It's an older one. Um, I'm going to try to see if I can get World of Tanks downloaded. Uh, if it'll play it off that, so we'll find out. Anyway, take care, people. Much clown love. Whoop, whoop. Hunter Valentine. Ken saying goodbye. Be well. Take care. Remember, never turn your back on fam. Never drop the axe. Remember, if you have a strong belief and you need it in your life, believe in something, be it God or anything. And remember, if anyone want to probe you, they said, tell them no. I know what's this. You just want to have butt sex. Anyway, peace. Whoop, whoop. Oh, by the way, Will of DC, I agree with you. Even though you report for YouTube, you did stand up on this one here saying YouTube will go down the tubes if they don't need to straighten up. I do approve of that, and I take back my statement saying that you're a reply girl. Anyway, take care, people.